Hello one and all and welcome back to Surgeon Simulator with our wonderful client wait no, yeah, client called Bob and the surgeon called like I don't know, Derek or something or Nigel. Nigel, yeah. Um I uh, I came back to this game because a lot of people said they liked it. When I say a lot, I mean about two. And someone spoke to me today and they said it was funny and that they liked it and so I said sure I'll make another you know who you are yeah you um anyway I I'm gonna I don't know which one I'm gonna do I don't wanna do the kidney transplant cause that's not I really don't like that one it's so fiddly and annoying so I think I'm gonna do brain transplant cause ironically enough the brain transplant is easier um I'm gonna take a guess at this. I have done it before, but it was a while ago. I'm just gonna smash his head in. In short. I don't know if there's a, a, a medical term of smashing in someone's head, but if there is, imagine I said that. Um... Well, I think he's just gone brain dead because he's just gone limp. So we're already doing well. Watch has fallen off. Try not to land that in his skull. There we go. Okay, he's not bleeding. Wonderful. Uh, I think we need to take more of the bone off around the outside. Yeah. Yeah, okay, that'll do, um... Oh, sh... fucking... This guy has, like, haemophilia or something. He bleeds incredibly quickly. <laughs> there you go. You gotta be careful now. He hasn't got much left in the old, uh... Well, in his head, in his body, blood-wise. Yeah, that, that's how you remove a brain. Ask any doctor, any brain surgeon, that's what they'll say. They'll say you massage it soothingly, and then it just pops out. It goes completely through your hand and then just pops out. Then you jab wildly at his brain cord, whatever it's called, with a uh, scalpel until his brain just comes out entirely. And then you get high by accidentally stabbing the antidote onto yourself and then you have to do it all under the intoxication of drugs, wonderful oh no I have to stab myself, there we go that's a really cool feature I think the fact that you can well drug yourself I don't know what that says about me. Don't. Oh crap, he is so nearly dead now. I'm not even sure if it's worth trying. Oh, for. Uh. You need to get off the, um, the drugs, Nigel. You don't know. Oh, for God's sake, man. You don't know what you're doing with your life anymore. Right. Oh, he is so nearly screwed now. I'm just gonna fuck it. There we go. Oh, his brain came out as well. Look at that brain flying gracefully through the air. Okay, we'll try again. Okay, same process, just better. How did he lose so much blood? It's got. It's supposed to have 5,600 milliliters, and he lost all of it. Probably because I was hitting him in the skull with a hammer. But. Okay, now I need stabbing in the face again. <sighs> Get off. Stab him in the eye. Um. Grab his head. Can we get it out? 
See? It's just about being gentle. You massage his brain with your fingers for a few seconds and it will literally just leap out of his skull. It's a beautiful process. Only only capable by professional doctors. And you stab him in the brain cord. And his brain just falls off. We don't need that anymore. Um, I'm going to stab him again just to make sure he doesn't... Just just in case he doesn't bleed completely. Just doesn't bleed completely out. Uh, I might not be in the best state to be doing surgery anymore. Okay, at least he's alright now. That's all that matters. As long as you're alright, Bob, I don't care what I have to go through. Whatever that may be. Right, this next part is a um, sophisticated, delicate process that I can't even begin to explain. So I'm just going to have to do it, and you're just going to have to watch. Um, basically, you just, uh, just drop it in there. There we go. You got a C. Wonderful. If only grades were that easy in real life. Uh, so yeah, two minutes and 2,915 milliliters of blood left. So that's that one done. Now, I've had this idea like just on the second. Just, just right out of the blue now. We can either do kidney transplant, the one that I'm not good at and I hate, or we can start doing the ambulance one, so it's all the same operations, but in an ambulance. Or we can do the space ones, such as the heart transplant, which I haven't done, so I can only do that one at the moment. Oh, look, she lied. Don't know what that means, but she lied. Um, so, yeah, comment... Or come on to contact with uh, with the page, even if you want. What one you want me to do next? Just put like ambulance heart or ambulance kidney or space heart, and um, I'll I'll um I'll see to doing it. Oh, oh, there's the team fortress one, which where well, it's pretty simple. I've already done it because it's got this fella, the medic. But we could do the team fortress one as well, which is cool. So yeah, comment whichever one you want, or message the page, or whatever, etc, etc. I hope you've all enjoyed... <sighs> Excuse me. I didn't know they actually answered the phone, that's brilliant. Um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, etc, etc. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and uh, bye.